get uh, a little bit of time away from training at, at times and uh, there's a, yeah, a number of charities uh, I like to help out. We've got the, obviously the Roosters uh, Steggles Charity Nest which are uh, really big on, on raising money and awareness for children's charities and I think we've raised over as a club and, and, as, and as Steggles as well as a brand has raised over 1.6 million in the last few years which is a, a huge amount which is great. The NOS Foundation, uh, East Group and the Roosters have been working uh, with those guys for a number of years now and obviously the East Leagues Club have purchased the building for, for the NOS Foundation which has been fantastic for the kids, uh, they just for somewhere to go and, and learn and, and educate themselves and uh, we come here regularly just to, to visit and um, today was uh, something special with the new plaque being announced as well so it was nice. A lot of our services in the community are really focused on working with kids with drug issues and, um, and that's really the thing that we do prominently in the community and, and, and around the country. So to have someone like Anthony by our side, you know, and, and really being able to show up and, and, and work with us, we're not a sexy charity, so it means a lot to us. And uh, just having Anthony by our side makes us a little bit sexier, should I say. <laughs> well, I love being around kids myself, you know. Uh, I love helping out charities, but you know, obviously I've started uh, my business Minifit as well, which are uh, health and fitness programs for primary school kids, so I love uh, working with kids and trying to not you know, inspire them in some way or educate them at a young age. Someone like Minnie who's had 16 years at, uh, at first grade level understands our commitments off the field and the want to do the charity work or the promotions off the field and the players love to do it, they feel they get attached to the people they work with and they feel like it's a part of their role here at, and the privilege that they get to play for the Roosters and, and in the NRL is to give it back to the community. And, and Minnie definitely understands that. He understands that uh, he's got to play football because of the people around him and, and he gives back uh, a hell of a lot to the, to the community of the Roosters. In his 15 years, what he has done for the club and what he, the hardship he's endured with his injuries leaves a very positive impact on everybody saying that, yeah, even though you've got hardships, you can still achieve. It's weird to think after, you know, I've been here for 18 years now and this, this will be my last season, but I'm really happy with the decision I made. Uh, I'm, I'm enjoying this last part of my career with, with the boys that I'm playing with and the club, uh, the guys that I'm working with. Uh, you know, hopefully I can leave a legacy of, um, of being a professional on and off the field.